Our hearts beat to the city streets. We begin to feel the fire. We rise like tall buildings as the chemicals they take us higher. The night's young and it's just begun as she puts her hand in mine. Hey everyone, it's the Clumsy Simmer here and welcome back to my channel or just welcome if you are new. Today we are in Create a Sim and I am creating a family for you guys. It is a base game only family and I built this for the Mediterranean mansion that I built. Base game only as well in Oasis Springs. You can check that out on my channel if you're interested. I will link it down below. Um, but... The Romanos are a successful family that recently moved to Oasis Springs. Nobody quite knows how they achieved their wealth, but the less questions asked, the better. <laughs> that is the description for this family. Um, just something quick and simple without getting too deep into their storyline, because at the time of making this family, I wasn't quite sure of the storyline I wanted to go with them. But um, they are a very wealthy, very successful family. They are also quite mysterious. They do not like sharing too much about themselves, especially when it comes to their job. Especially Tony, because he actually is in the criminal career. He is the boss in the criminal career, so he holds lots of secrets. Uh, not many people know his actual profession. Um, and that is actually why they recently moved to o Oasis Springs because their fo former neighborhood of Willow Creek, all of the neighbors started catching on to Tony's criminal ways. So they had to make a quick escape. And so they decided to move over to Oasis Springs into that fabulous mansion. So as you can see, I am pretty much done with Tony's look and I'm just adding in his outfits now. So um, yeah, let's get into his traits really quick. He is materialistic, a loner, and he is very ambitious. Um, I thought those three traits fit him really well since he is in the criminal career. Most, you know, not that I am a criminal, but I just feel like most criminals you would think would be a loner. They're not going to be out, you know, at the bar talking to random people about their personal life. They're going to pretty much stick with themselves and probably stick with other criminals, right? So um, I thought loner felt fit great. Ambitious, of course, fits great because he has to get to the top of the criminal career track somehow. And materialistic just comes with the territory. You know, big, nice houses typically are materialistic type of people, right? So, um, yeah, we are finishing up Tony's look now. I wanted to keep, you know, him in a nice suit for most of his outfits. I thought that made sense for Tony. He doesn't seem like the type of sim that's really going to dress down very often. And, um... Now we are getting into Alessandra. She is the mother. She is also fabulously wealthy. And she is not in the criminal career, though. She ends up being in the business career. And I believe I promoted her to one of the top tier levels on the management side, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know. I, now that I'm thinking about it, maybe I should have put her more on the investor side. I thought that made makes more sense for her. Um, you know, she doesn't seem like the type of Sam that's going to sit in the office managing people all day. She seems more of like the investor type, like, here, take my money and make more of it, okay? Um, but I might go back and change that before I actually share them on the gallery. But um, as far as her traits go... She also is ambitious, and she's also outgoing, and she is romantic. And with the way she turned out in the end, her look, I thought, 
you know, those traits fit her really well. She is, she definitely looks to be very outgoing, you know, she can walk into the room and light it up. Everyone will always have their eyes on her. She really looks like she could have been a model back in her prime. But um, yeah, so she loves her family. She is not family oriented, but that does not mean she does not love her family very much. She will do anything for her family, and if anybody tries to hurt her family, she will probably hurt them. <laughs> but yeah, so we are just adding some makeup to her everyday look. I could not decide the color lipstick I wanted to go with, but I thought she looked the best with like this darker red. And then I just added some highlighter and some eyeliner and some eyeshadow and then I had those green eyes on her but I just thought the brown it just suited her so well and um, I added some nice earrings and now we are into her outfits that dress just it just complemented her shape so well so I had to use it and added a necklace make her look like she actually lives in a nice mansion um i wanted them to look very wealthy very put together um and i think i achieved that in the end for everybody in the family the two kids were kind of hard you know what teenager or child is going to wear like a suit all the time or like a dress all the time you know unless it's like a casual dress of course but i don't see any kids in real life actually wearing tuxes and stuff all the time so I ended up not putting them in very nice outfits I kind I wanted to keep it true with their personalities and I'll get that get into that later when we uh, start putting them together but I'm just finishing up uh, all of Alessandra's outfits now uh, we are on formal and now we are going to athletic and I wanted to keep you know, everything as nice as possible, but still suited for the outfit category. So the athletic wear for Alessandra, I don't know, wasn't my favorite. I feel like base game is lacking on athletic wear. It's either, you know, like super casual or super girly. There's nothing really for the proper Sims, I feel like. Maybe that jacket, but I don't think I end up going with that jacket. I'm, I'm, I guess I did, but um, now we're just, you know, doing her PJs. Something I love to do for the female Sims, and sometimes the male Sims too. The male Sims, I'll put the heart-shaped heart boxers on them. But on the female Sims, I love to put like, you know, one, one outfit in the PJ wear will be just their regular pajamas. But then the other one, I like to put them in like a lingerie set. <laughs> I mean, I feel like that's pretty realistic. Most, most women, I feel like, put on some lingerie for their significant other. But, um... Yeah, we did the party wear and now we are over into the swimwear for Alessandra and I love those floppy hats. I feel like they look so nice on the Sims, especially for like the wealthier Sims. I feel like it just adds a, a touch of something to the swimwear or even, you know, the outerwear, like the hot wear, whatever you want to call that. Um, those floppy hats really are cute. They add something to the outfit. And now we are just finishing up. We are over into the cold weather outfit. And I wanted to keep it true to her wealthy aesthetic, but it was hard to do it for the cold weather wear as well. I ended up just sticking with this outfit here. Now we are just adding some makeup and some last minute touches, going over her outfits and I also love giving my sims these different walk styles. Um, I give my female sims a lot of the time like the uh, cute, flirty, girly walk style. I probably overuse it quite often. Uh, the normal one, you know, is just normal. And then the male one, I love the tough one. And 
the I don't remember what the other one's called, but it's like the cool guy walk, you know, like the swagger walk. I like those too. Some of them are very questionable and not that great, but anyways, we are over into the son of the family. He is a teenager and his name is Rocco Romano and his traits. I did not do a story for him because I wanted to take the parents' genetics and make their kids so you know you can't do the story for that so I ended up choosing his traits for him his traits end up being a goofball and a music lover and he wants to be a musical genius um, and I tried to keep that true with the outfit that I chose for him I thought that was something a teenage boy would wear especially if he was into like music and kind of like an alternative style um, I thought that fit Rocco really well. We are just adding some of his other outfits like the formal wear you've seen. I thought that fit him. He didn't really have a tie on or a bow tie or anything. It was kind of just like a suit and a button up shirt. I thought that, you know, went true for his personality. He is more of an alternative type of Sim. He loves guitar and he loves singing those are his passions when he is older he hopes to become a musical genius he wants to become like a famous musician basically and he actually just met a girlfriend at high school and they started dating recently she is not the best influence on him. Uh, both of his parents noticed once he started dating this new girl, he started, you know, acting out quite often. He started sneaking out at night. His grades started to drop. He started, you know, giving them some attitude, so to speak. He just stopped listening altogether. <laughs> Just like teenagers do, I feel like everyone has like a teenage phase like that, a rebellious phase. At least most people do. I know I did. I wasn't that bad, but I did put my mom through some stuff sometimes. <laughs> Nothing too bad, but I gave her some attitude. But anyways, we are on to the daughter of the family. This is little Sophia, and I chose her trait as well and I gave her outgoing. She just seems like a very much, a very social little girl. She loves to meet new people. She loves having, you know, her friends come over for sleepovers or just to hang out. And so that is why I gave her the aspiration of social butterfly. And so as she grows older, I kind of figured she will want to be something like a politician, I kind of feel like for her. Something that involves her being very outgoing and meeting other people. Maybe she'll even end up following into her mother's footsteps and go into the business career. I do not remember if the politician career is base game or not, but um... But yeah, the this is the Romano family. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you did, please like, please subscribe, please share. It would really help me out a lot. I, you know, I'm quite new to YouTube. This is only like my fourth video or so. So really, any support that you guys give me, I really do appreciate it. It really makes my day. If I get just one view, it makes my day. But um, yeah, so I will leave you to enjoy the rest of this video. Oh, and of course, this family is available for download on the gallery. If you are interested, I will link my gallery down below. So I hope you enjoyed this, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye! A heart speed to the city streets We begin to feel the fire We rise like tall buildings as the chemicals, they take us higher The night's young, and it's just begun As she puts her hand in mine We wanna chase the night Wanna dance to the light Pull the stars from the sky Just two hearts running wild Never sleep, never stop Every shot from the top
it's running wild. 